today we're looking at the black swan and what a gorgeous bird with a nice snaky looking neck I'm the snake artist and I draw some of the most beautiful animals in the world when I don't use photos I don't always get the best sketch but I love doing this and I want to share it with you so come along on the adventure as I fill my journal with some of the most amazing wildlife been reading up on early European contact with the black swan. Hold on, I stick my glasses on. Not that I've got weak eyes mind you. Just makes me look smarter. Okay, so yeah it's really interesting that this seems like a very vulnerable species in that, uh, well they basically say here you're as row fast and you'll catch up to them. Uh, and so they were catching swans cooking their eggs, eating them of course. Here's one quote. As we ascended the river we saw many swans. Our boat knocked over nine or ten. So uh, you sort of think that uh, a species like this would just disappear. However they were high in number and they don't really pose much of a threat. Uh, animals that pose a threat are much more hated some animals are hated for no really good reason at all. In Australia the black swan's not really a hated species and in my experience um, whereas you go into a park you can get very close to these guys out in the wild in the wetlands uh, they fly off before you get near them unless they've got babies of course. One of the interesting things is they tried to uh, introduce the black swan into Europe and England and places like that and a bit of speculation on as to why these guys didn't take I mean they should have a real big predators for them they should have done well uh, it's interesting that uh, people associate black animals with Satan and seeing a black swan a lot of the superstitious people in the uh, 18th century and early 19th century would see them as a witch's companion and want to kill them and chase them off and that's probably what stopped them from being successful in building up numbers in, in Europe. And so I, I, I just love the underdog, I, I just love animals that people hate and there's no real good reason and in Australia now they're not hated, in fact people love them, well, good on them too actually a symbol for Western Australia where these guys were first seen by Europeans was Western Australia and that's where they've become pretty much like the emblem of Western Australia like um, flags and stamps and that in early Western Australia featured the black swan and of course the swan is a beautiful shape it's like a snake like shape which is probably one of the things that attracts my eye to it and I especially like that little bit of white and a little bit of red on the beak there. Uh, it's uh, just that little flash of colour uh, leading up into the black. I just find that very interesting and very appealing. And I think the black swan is a nice addition to my ever-growing wildlife journal. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, maybe check out some of these other videos and maybe check out some of the products I have on Redbubble, link down below. And I'll see you in the next video.